Okay, so it's time for a tiny tech review. Um, I've been having some problems now with the drone for a little bit. Um, I've got a, an ND32 filter installed on the camera um, to cut down the light because being Australia is very bright here. But I'm still having a lot of trouble with uh, whiteout and um, things like that when you turn towards the sun. Um, even to the point now that it's interfering with the um, anti-collision system so I keep getting a lot of false warnings saying um, you're going to collide with something and the drone will bank up and stop abruptly uh, especially if I'm flying towards the sun. So I've gotten hold of an ND32 polarized filter, this is the polarized pro um, filter and I'm going to give this a try to see whether or not this will solve the problem. Alright so this is the package as you can see inside there's the filter you can get a whole bunch of other ones but I figured it was only worth getting the 32 because uh, it's the brightest one and it's the one I tend to use the most anyway uh, I really haven't had a requirement to use the lesser grade ones it's always just so much sunnier so um, I'll have a look what's in the package it's got a snazzy little box Okay, so inside we've got the filter. Okay, there it is there, and that just slips onto the lens of the camera on the Mavic Pro. Okay, we've got this little baggie. So there's a little lens baggie there. That's good. And we've got a sticker. And it looks like some instructions. Alright, well I'll have a look at those. I don't know how you can install it wrong really only just pushes onto the lens and a card that doesn't do anything alright so that's everything alright let's get the drone out and see how it goes on there we go these are my regular um, DJI uh, filters so I think it's an 8, 16 and a 32 uh, I don't think they're polarized, I think they're just straight ND filters. So unfortunately you've got to get a lot of glare. Alright. So these ones they just clip on very carefully. So just remove that. Like so. Just fit the Polar Pro on. Okay, that's it. As you can see, it looks quite snazzy, fits on there quite well. I don't think it's going to fall off. So, the next thing to do will be to give them a test and compare and see how much better it fares out in the sunlight. Okay, we've come out to test the uh, ND polarizing filter. Uh, it's still a bit windy, but um, we'll give it a go. And uh, hopefully it won't blow away again.
right, that seems like a big improvement. The um, sky looks a lot better, it's a lot more wiped out, uh, not as whited out, and the picture is a lot more even, so I would say that's a huge success. I definitely recommend picking up the polarizing filter if you live in a bright environment. It uh, definitely makes a big difference to your photos. So that's my quick little tech review. Um, I hope that was helpful to you. I hope that you're uh, going to check out the Polar Pro filters now. Um, they're excellent uh, for your drone. Um, honestly, I don't know why DJI doesn't put something on the lenses uh, when they ship them so that there's some kind of anti-glare film or whatever because uh, it makes a lot of sense. Um, but anyway, check them out and uh, hopefully I'll have something else for you to review soon. If you like the review, um, please subscribe below and click the little bell, the little bell, um, so that you get notifications when there are more videos from me. Uh, we'll be trying to make more and uh, look out hopefully for some new tech reviews soon. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.